the Jingsha River turns eastward. Danxia landform resembles a screen. An Asian town with green tiles and red walls has passed down for thousands of years. Its name is Asian Town of Mahu Prefecture. Do you still remember scenes from a Disney movie Up? The old character used thousands of blooms to fly his house to South America. And today we have come to a Mahu Asian Town in the Pingshan Yibing. And there are 42 Asian buildings are reloaded from the upstream from the Jingsha River. Why do these Asian buildings shall fly to this place? In 2006, due to the construction of Xiangjiaba Hydropower Station, the old county town of Pingshan and five surrounding towns will be submerged. To perceive valuable historical resources along the river bank from being submerged, Sichuan Province has launched its largest ever ground cultural relics protection project. It involves the relocation and faithful reconstruction of 42 ancient buildings dating back to the Song, Ming, and Qing dynasty. So you may have a question that how to reload these 42 ancient buildings across about 19 kilometers to this place. The answer is under these numbers. As you can see the number 225 on this brick, the engineers had numbered every brick, every column, every beam, every tie, and the special structure we called Dogon when they moved them to the old town of Mafu Prefecture. And the next step is to assemble this like Lego and to reconstruct this whole old town. For dismantling in 2012 to officially starting reconstruction in 2016, engineers following the principles of ancient building restoration spent four years to clean and repair the materials that had been dismantled. According to the drawing numbers, each brick and tile should be restored one by one, allowing the ancient town of Mahu Prefecture to reborn near the Jingsha River. As we all know, these buildings in the ancient town of Mahu Prefecture, not only from the different places of the downstream area of Jingsha River, but also they do have the typical features of different Chinese dynasties. The Wanshou Temple has originally built in the late Southern Song Dynasty, representing the architecture style of that period. In particular, the case of Guan Yin Ho, which in the Wanshou Temple has a cross hand at both ends of the main ridge of the Bing frame, and a substitute wood after the chess game. This construction method was only available in the Tang and Song Dynasty. The Enjiang Gate, built in the Longqing period of the Ming Dynasty, was a representative example of Ming Dynasty architecture in this ancient town. The gate tower is a wooden structure designed as a post and lintel structure with gable roof and double eaves. The three characters in Jiangmen were handwritten by Zhang Shiying, the magistrate of Mahu Prefecture in the Ming Dynasty. Viral stickers and wooden carvings are a distinctive feature of Qing Dynasty architecture in this ancient town. The residence of Wang family built in the late Qing Dynasty. At the main entrance, five bad shapes are formed to use a fragment of blue and white porcelain. In Chinese, bad and lucky have the same pronunciation. So bats also have a symbolic meaning of good luck. This name is Gu Lei Yuzi. It was opened in the past few years. In the past few years, the first part of the Pinsan district was created by the first part of the Pinsan district. 
。十六年之后，安上县改为茅埠县。随着朝代的更替，在唐代，在整个平川地区就建立了茅埠鸡鸣州。到了元代，就设立了茅埠路。再到清代，也就是雍正五年（一七二七年），随着改土归流的推进，就拆掉了茅埠府。在这五千年的历史变迁的岁月中，平山。跟随着历史长河的变迁，也留下了很多丰富的文化遗产，比如江苏文化、福建族文化，以及我们的移民文化和商贸文化。在我们现如今的马夫夫古城里面，都有这些文化的体现。